What is up my kings, my queens, my royals in between? I'm Lord Russell, this is Pokemon Fool's Gold, and if you missed last episode, we didn't know what to nickname Eevee, and I still couldn't figure it out in between uh, ending the recording and starting this recording, so we're going to name it Bill for now, based on the man that who, uh, gave it to us, and that, that's literally just what we're going to do, and for some reason my controller decided to stop working. I don't know why it started to do this, I don't know if it's my controller or what, but either way, kind of annoying. But, we're continuing to Nuzlocke. Oh, also, uh, we made it through Whitney without losing anybody, but we lost Zatpuff to a wild uh, coughing that we were trying to catch because it knew self-destruct for some reason. At level 19. So, there's that. Oh, also, we uh, finally hatched the one egg, and uh, with that, we got ourselves a shiny Mantike, which is kind of nuts. So, uh, so our, our little buddy uh, Kite Runner here is going to uh, be on the team for now. And the plan is realistically, I'm not going to even bother using Mantike at any point in time during this, and I'm going to train it up off stream because y'all don't want to see me have to baby a Pokemon for an hour. It, it, it's, it's not going to be fun for you. It's not going to be fun for me. So we're just, we're. We're gonna just do that off stream, but you know, fingers crossed that we'll be able to enjoy a uh, a shiny Pokemon. All right, I'm fairly confident that's that's how that normally looks. Because if we didn't get like an actual shine with uh, well, when uh, Mantike hatched. Wow, we just exploded that thing. God damn. So I'm I'm now not hyper confident of us actually getting any kind of indication of shinies, but maybe they just didn't have shiny uh, animations for hatching. Because you know that the Gyarados should still have the shiny animation at the very least. Um, okay, so we did all those... Oh yeah, we can do the Kabuki girls. I know we can check over to the right because the the Pokemon in the caves aren't that bad. Da, 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 da. Okay, I don't because this leads me to the yeah, this leads me to the tower, which you won't actually let me. Yeah, yeah, because you can't go to the ten tower and then you can't go even further with that. It's like meh. Uh, outside of Twitch and YouTube, what other pla social platforms are you utilizing? I'm just doing Twitch and YouTube and Twitter mostly. Uh, yeah, so Twitch and YouTube are probably my biggest two for sure. Uh, TikTok, I'm only really utilizing it to help format my videos, uh, my shorts for, uh, for the YouTube shorts. Because for whatever reason, I don't know why, but, like, even if I have it in, like, the right format, the the 1080 by 1920 so like the vertical format like like that's how i made my short if i try and upload from my phone it immediately tries to turn it into just like a regular video so and i i don't know what the disconnect is there specifically but if i run it through tiktok first then it'll recognize oh this is a vertical format so but i mainly use tiktok for turning my uh, videos into like actual shorts that will actually, you know, make, like make it like be uploadable from my phone. Other than that, I don't, I don't care about uh, TikTok. I will say like, I've been thinking about trying to like live stream to TikTok because I think all you have to do is download their live creator or thing or whatever. And from what I can tell when it comes to like gaming stuff on TikTok, you'd much rather do that with lives rather than actually going through and doing things. So, yeah. And then uh, Twitter, but I don't. It's, I don't really get anything crazy off of Twitter. I, I, I use that for going lives and like retweeting things. I mainly have been using um, Twitter to find like more indie games and more fan-made Pokemon games, actually. Which has been the main reason why I specifically just purely uh, stick to the 
for you tab for uh, Twitter. Right, I want Rock Smash to smash that, okay. Ooh, Cubone. Alright. I don't know if you're gonna try and run away again, so I'm going to immediately throw a Great Ball at you and just see if I get lucky. I make my shorts on my desktop, I don't seem to have- I also make my shorts on- on the desktop. I- I know- So, I don't know why it does that. Your guess is as good as mine, but for whatever reason, when uploading from my phone onto YouTube, if I just do the straight video, it doesn't immediately recognize it as a short, and I don't know why. Only thing I can think of is maybe it has something to do with... I use... Okay, no, I also use DaVinci Resolve. And I, I use the vertical... The vertical setting. Okay, cool, you're not running away this time. Alright, that's, that's huge. We might be able to get a cube on here. Very weird. Hmm. Yeah, I don't... I don't know. I might have to check something now that I'm sitting here thinking about it. Because... Uh, okay, real quick, let me read this. Uh, Cubo and Lonely Ghost. Uh, these sorrowful Pokemon have no home to return to, wandering um, unpopulated areas in search of family. That is sad. Yeah. All right, nickname for Cubone. Um, you know what? We're gonna nickname it Stitch because it's looking for family. And so we're gonna give it an Ohana and uh, Ohana means family and family means never getting left behind. Uh, let me see if I can teach somebody uh, Rock Smash real quick. But yeah, I'm just now thinking about it because I'm just started realizing that they have an, like an actual like specific button to do vertical format. I've been just changing the dimensions itself and maybe that might be the thing. So I'll have to double check on that. Uh, I don't want Jotaro to know. Uh, Smooth through will probably be a good, a good rock smash to be honest. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. We get rid of Fury Swipes because we just don't want it. At worst, I can always get rid of Rock Smash and then pick it back up later. Because it's not like I can only use Rock Smash to learn something once. HP up, noise. But yeah, maybe, maybe it's because I'm not actually hitting the vertical settings and I'm just changing the dimensions of the video and that's why it's acting weird because I, I cause sitting here thinking about it I never actually tried anything different for uh, uh what's the word I'm looking for okay so they do run away so we just got lucky with that keyboard nice but like I never tried something different for uh for the uh, Pokemon Infinite Fusions that I've been working through, which I think I'm only on episode five of Pokemon Infinite Fusions, uh, like making clips from those. And I still have like a bunch to go through and I still got a bunch of uh, episodes to go through before I'm like completely done with that. So I'm gonna be making shorts of that for a long time, which is nice. Okay, I just wanted to see if there's actually anything there. Um, I think we, I think we should be fine to fight him. But I have at least done the vertical setting specifically for my Diddy Kong Racing and my Dark Souls stuff. It's just Diddy Kong Racing is the majority of that's over a minute long, and YouTube doesn't do anything past a minute for shorts. And. But at the very least, all my uh, Dark Souls stuff is actually like that. So I might have to try, see if that makes a difference. But I haven't had any problem with getting okay enough views uh, with having like the TikTok watermarks or anything like that. Weeping Bell. 
Right, you're a big old cannon. Honestly, incredibly cool. Like, I, like, legit like that. Uh, Rock Smash. You know what? That's, that's, that's pretty good. Barrage. Haha, <laughs> you missed your barrage. Get smashed. Haha! <laughs> Not even a crit. Oh, that's right, because it's defense drop. That actually worked out really well. Hot damn. You go smooth, true. Please learn a dark move. You son of a bitch, you're trying to learn Fury Swipes again? No! Get out of here. I don't want Fury Swipes. I'm mad that you got rid of Faint Attack. Quilava. Ice. Honestly, I should still be able to Rock Smash. Eh, okay, still not as good. Honestly, Smart Call using Mist, because that's... Wait, is that... to think does is mist what gets rid of stat changes or is it something similar to mist and i'm just not remembering what it, what it is off the top of my head i feel like it's mist magnemite have we seen a magnemite i feel like we have and eh, screw it we'll keep smoothing around and we'll work with it right it's a weird little jelly dude um, false plate? Just okay. That's neutral damage at least. Go for the acid armor that raises your defense way up. Apparently, so we're gonna go with cut. Smooth. Oh, are you straight poison now? Please don't poison my smooth true. Yeah, you bitch. I told you not to. Rock smash. Maybe because it doesn't matter at this point. Alright, and then you're gonna send out Zubat, which we know is Psychic Flying, which unfortunately we don't have anything to specifically work against that. Uh, uh, screw it, Jotaro. Because I'm not gonna keep Smooth True out there at this point. Oh crap, I should have went for bite. I forgot we had bite. I mean, not, not that we clearly need it. Penny! Okay, we can, we, we can give Penny a break after uh, chat pushes me down a hole. Hi Penny. Yes, your mother asked for you. And, and by asked for you, I meant uh, to take you out. Because clearly you're being a grump. Yeah, you can give me those eyes all you want. I, you're, you're being a grump. Oh, whatever. You would never be able to catch a legendary Pokemon anyways. <laughs> what are you doing falling into a hole? Some genius you are. Serves you right. Oh, chat. You're a jerk. Alright, uh, real quick before I take Penny out, because if I don't, I will forget, and then we will have a poison smooth through, and it'll be bad time. All right, everybody, give me a few moments. Uh, Twitch, enjoy some old Clippy Clips. Uh, YouTube, I will catch you after this cut. All right, we are back, and uh, apologies uh, to everybody on Twitch. I forgot how oppressive the uh, Game Boy music is compared to the, uh, to the old Clippy Clips. So, yeah, sorry, sorry you didn't actually get to enjoy any of that. on the other side. Alright, let's get these doggos activated. And yes, they're dogs. They're not cats. I mean, arguably, they're beasts. Like, that's specifically what they're supposed to be. They're beasts, but you know, that's not really here nor there. I'm excited to see what these are going to turn into. It, again, if you've seen Pokemon 3D, you, you'll know that we got all three of the legendary dogs, and I'm very excited to attempt this again. Uh, I dug a hole down here too. I was shocked. Uh, Suicune raced by like a blur of, like a blur right in front of my eyes. Uh, for 10 years, I chased Suicune, and I finally got to see it. I'm all choked up. Rostal, I owe you this all to you. Thank you. Uh, 
uh, I heard that the legendary Pokemon of Ecrotique test chosen humans by allowing them to get close. I'm going to track sweep and Rossmo lets meet again. What did you say, buddy? Okay, did you my controller really do the thing again? It did. Alright, so good enough. Let's go heal. Alright. So, trying to think, trying to think. We got the left side, we got the right side, and we got the Kabukis. I think we could probably, uh, like, no matter what the deal is for the Kabukis, I think we could probably get away with fighting at least one of them. Even if we have to, like, s constantly switch out to kind of, like, preserve health and all that, I think we can get away with whatever. Not even knowing who we're going up against or anything like that. It also doesn't help that they're all different types now, and if we end up running into... Alright. You have lovely Pokemon. May I see them in battle? Well, I, I will... I will show you my Pokemon. Please do not have something stupid strong. Alright, you are sending out Flareon. Oh, good, the dragon. 24. Okay, so... Honestly, this probably... One of our better chances. Okay, let's go with Metal Claw. That did okay damage. Sand attack. Okay, good. You missed. Alright, let's go with a cut because we can get that stab damage at least. Oh, look at that. Critical hit. Beautiful. Okay, cool. Hot damn. Oh, you're very strong. Okay, so if you're gonna be 24s, I can probably get away with running Jotaro through the next couple. But I don't want to have Dino and Rubber Gone. I was like, who else do we have that isn't already 25? It's Rubber Gone. Espeon, which is a bug type, which actually works out perfectly well against uh, Jotaro here, but Espeon B, sure. Also, having confusion. Okay, so even if you crit again, I'll be fine. Okay, beautiful. beautiful. Alright, we're definitely gonna go heal up after this. Because we're not losing our boy Jotaro. At least not at least not yet. We at the very least got our starter past where we lost our starter a starter last time. Also Hello? Who, who are you? That no, go away. That's weird. Oh, hi Penny. Alright, let me scooch forward. So what we'll do is we'll get everybody to 25. Realistically, we're not taking on Morty tonight. I can't I can't see that happening, right? Honestly, we should probably push a little bit past 25 because I think that's going to be better off for us. But I think we'll just take everyone to 25 and kind of go from there because I don't think Morty has a lot of Pokemon. All right, so I'm trying to think things that we want to try. Actually, you know what? I, again, I don't even know who's going who's, who's gonna to be what, so it doesn't matter. I know Jolteon's Steel now. Umbreon is Ghost. Oh, perfect. Yeah, Umbreon's a little mummy. All right, let's go for the bite. Mm, super effective, not a lot. But again, it's bite's not super strong, and we're not getting stab damage out of it, so we're probably gonna do. Hmm, interesting. So we did about the same either way. So Umbreon clearly still has the same uh, overall setup that Umbreon's normally have, which is tanky as fuck. So we're gonna keep biting and hope for uh, flinches, even though it's gonna be dead next turn. It's not gonna matter. 
God. Who here remembers when rap used to be absolutely broken? And if you, uh... If you, uh, like, wrapped a Pokemon, they wouldn't get a turn. So you could uh, essentially just wrap a Pokemon to death if you really wanted to. Especially if you had the speed on them. Okay, cool. So, oh, I did not know I could just jump off the stage like that. That's actually kind of hilarious. All right, uh, so, all right. Let's put out Dino out front, because I feel like I can at least trust Dino to survive some of these Pokemon. Let's go ahead and check out this way first, because I feel like this way will at least give us a little bit more variety. Wait, up? The, the F is this? Uh, uh, okay, hold on, hold on. Poke gear, map. Wait, hold on. Tumble? What the f Jungle maze? The crap is this? Okay, so they- okay, they've added in some- okay, hold on. Ooh. Okay, so we need Surf here, but okay, interesting. Okay, we'll definitely have to remember that this is here. Alright, root for the two! Alright, Ultra Ball? Ultra awesome! Oh yeah, I need to get at least one Pokémon with Thunder Wave. Mount Mortar, okay. I don't think anybody's too wildly strong in here if I remember correctly either. So I think we can get away with do maybe doing a couple battles. Da -da -da -da. I'm not gonna lie, do we have a Zubat? No, we don't have a Zubat. Alright, realistically, you should be able to handle a Dragon Rage, right? I feel like you should be able to handle a Dragon Rage. Because if I have 54 health at 22, you have to have at least more than 40. Probably like not much more. Yeah, that's about what I figured there. Alright. Uh, all right, we're gonna go Great Ball just to save us any kind of trouble. Huge! All right, and we already know what we're gonna nickname Zubat because my original nickname uh, for the little bit that I played before we decided to re completely restart and do a Nuzlocke was Top Notch. All right, Zubat, Eyeball, Psychic Flying. Uh, Spelunkers often feel a sense of paranoia from glimpses of Zubat lurking in the shadows. Creepy. And we are going to aptly name this... I... Eyesore. And if you don't understand why that's hilarious, um... Let me know in the comments down below and I will explain it to you. And hopefully... Hopefully after I explain it, you'll get it and you'll agree that that's an absolutely hilarious, hilarious nickname. Alright, I should probably not... Mm, okay, Dino's probably dead. Not dead. Really good. Okay, Pokemon. We're swapping. We're not taking the chance. Um, we don't act, we don't, oh yeah, that's right, hmm. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go Smooth True. Smooth True's probably the safest bet here. I probably could have honestly gotten away with a double Dragon Rage if I would have just full committed to it, but I just assumed if it got the water gun off, it would have just absolutely wrecked me. And it wouldn't have, and it just wouldn't have been worth it. All right, twenty-three for Dino. That's huge. Come on, Dino, evolve, please. <gasps> Dino's evolving. Let's go. And th again, this is why we named it Dino. If it wasn't obvious from the first bit, th this is why we named it Dino. All right. 
Togetic, Dinosaur, Ground. Slow and steady, these Pokemon prefer drier climates and can go up to weeks without food or water. Beautiful. Alright, I don't know where Dino's stats were beforehand, but let's see where they jumped up to now that they are... At least evolved. 51 attack, 51 defense, special attacks down in the crapper, which perfectly fine. Special defense, 56. Dino good. Dino good. Okay, okay. Honestly, we got, we got some good stuff going right here. Alright, um... I don't know if I was smart enough to... Actually, uh, grab Dino. Uh, I believe... No, wait, I was. Cool. Oh, I gotta resize that. Ah, Alright, let me just... There we go. That's good. That's good. Honestly, not that bad. Not that bad. After compressing it down a little bit, the the minor blurriness that it has, gone. Not, not mad about it. Uh, okay, Dino's still, like, half health after, after evolving. I'm good with that. Uh... Yeah, we picked up the Zubat. We could do a little bit more in here, which we honestly probably will. Mainly because I want to see if that one trainer still has a Nido King and a Nido Queen, just to see what those look like. Um, Alright, just out of curiosity. Honestly, pretty good. Disabled, not, not great for me, but not a big deal. I'm already moving faster than you anyways. And headbutts should just wreck you. Beautiful. I should probably honestly get rid of Mud Slap for Dig. That'd probably be a smart call. We'll worry about that in a moment. Also, yeah, now I'm sitting here thinking, I definitely would not now have wasted money on both a Fire Punch and Thunder Punch. Because unless when Corsola evolves, it, I mean, if we can even get Corsola to evolve, because I think it needs a Dusk Stone in this to evolve from what I remember seeing. Like, if we do that, if we can get it to evolve, I don't think it's still, I still don't think it technically gets hands. So I don't know if it'll be able to fire punch. Which kind of, you know, defeats the overarching purpose. Oh, cool, Bate. Okay, all right. Um, well, obviously because you're flying, that's not gonna do us any good. All right, we're gonna go for a headbutt. Oh, I also just, I just realized you're also level 24. Jeebus. Um, okay, I could probably get what. Ri mm, Claire, that's not great. I could probably get away with a, uh, a dragon rage here, right? One solid headbutt and then a dragon rage. I'm at 65. Really? You still had more? All right, I'm gonna go one more dragon rage just to, you know, be safe. Please don't hurt yourself. Damn it. Come on, Dino. Get it together. Wait, special events? No, Leer is regular defense. Did they change Leer to drop special defense for some reason? I mean, I'm not hurting on money, and I, no, I, I, yeah, I, I don't want to have to go and run back. So let, let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. Go for the headbutt. But honestly, this is good training right here. Solid level twenties. I don't remember running into like this, like the like. I feel like I was normally running into like like 15s to 18s uh, in Pokemon 3D. So I don't know if Fool's Gold changed this up a bit or what. But I'm I'm enjoying this. Makes me minorly worried about what. He, <laughs> no. All right, fighting type. All right, we're gonna go for Bulldoze here. We'll at least get the stab damage. 
solid like half health, drop your speed. Alright, bite shouldn't be that big of a deal. But yeah, no, this is gonna be a good spot to like train up and get ready for Morty, for sure. And by good spot, I mean I would I would have hoped it would have been at least a little bit better. Bum, 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 bum. Ah yes, earthworm. 10 out of 10, if we ever caught a Onyx, we would 100% just nickname him Jim. Ooh, because we are... Okay, Bulldoze misses. I can't... I don't think ground is, like, super effective against ground, right? You know what, just in case... Let's just play it smart. I don't want to lose Dino after we just got them to evolve. Haha! -ha, you thought... And I'm pretty certain Onyx is just... Okay, so... We're gonna... Mi so we'll waste a scratch, because it doesn't matter. I'm guessing you have no other options, huh? Yeah, you got no other options. So sorry to rain on your parade, Onyx. One more. Okay, thank you for at least using something different. Thank you for accepting your defeat. Alright, let's go outside. Mainly because I just want to see real quick. I don't remember what is necessarily up ahead. Oh, hey, look, uh, a scissor. Which is just a fighting type. Oh, wait, you're bug fighting. That's right, so. Ground is not your deal. Okay, yeah, new with. Okay, I'm glad I took the time to just go Dragon Rage because now you're gonna defense curl and yeah, I'm not, I'm not about that. I'll just, I'll just do two free things of 40 and just be happy with it. Ooh. Hmm, 714? Okay, I'll, I'll fight some more scissors. Not necessarily that I want to fight them now, but like if another one were to show up, like I wouldn't say no. Alright, going for the headbutts. Come on, flinch, be a homie? Nope. Alright. Uh, I didn't, like if it was just a regular attack, I'd probably be okay with it, but it doing that makes me not want to deal with it. Plus, this will also probably be a good time to get Campfire some experience. But this should get... Oh, wait, Campfire doesn't need experience. What am I doing? Um, so all that's left is Rubber Gone. Which won't necessarily do good or bad, necessarily, against any of the other Pokemon here. Alright, um, I think you guys all want to battle, and I'm not about to start battling any of you. Because I don't know what level your Pokemon are going to be. I'm at least confident that you are not going to have anything crazy. I'm not losing this time. Sh sure, buddy. It's like, do I even know you? Pokemaniac Miller. Nido King. Oh, okay, that's kind of cool. That's kind of like incredibly cool. Holy cow, I like that. Also, level 30, that's scary. I've I've made a mistake coming here. Um, water gun. Thun? How do you know Thundershock? Shit. Okay, we're gonna lose rubber gun here 100%. Alright, let's see Oh, that didn't do a lot. Okay, what in the world are you? If you know Thundershock, then Dino should be fine. If you know Thundershock, Dino should be fine. Mm. Alright, 
Uh, we got we got some super potions. We got some super potions. That'll be fine. This is, this is okay. We're okay. I would have just assumed that you would have went for another thunder shock to wipe out Rubbergon. Going for a double kick in that situation, kind of nuts. All right, I can survive another double kick easy. Bulldoze. I'm hoping. Really, bro? Get wrecked, Needle King. Get out of here. Okay, I can't. I mean, would Needle Queen be the same setup? I, I'm, you know, what? I'm gonna switch anyways, just in case. Are you a hippo? Are you are you a hunk? Like, mm, rollout's not great. Rollout is not great. Mm, that did not do a lot of damage. Okay. Um. Uh. Maybe I can get lucky with a burn. Okay, you missed. Huge. Mm, okay, cool. That drops your physical attack by 30%. Huge. Um, go another Ember. Roll out again. Not a lot. I will recover next turn. Didn't do that much damage. We were hurt by burn. Huge. Release from the fire spin. Okay. So now here comes the problem. If you hit your rollout again, campfire is realistically dead. Right? And you move first no matter what. Um, I don't think there's anything that I can switch to that will be able to tank the rollout anyways maybe smooth through but I don't know if I wanna I don't know if I wanna do that I don't know if I wanna do that I think campfire is too important if we have to lose somebody I'd, I'd rather it be smooth through I hate that I'm doing this but I'm hoping smooth through can tank it Oh my god. Why did that... I feel like that should have done so much more. Interesting. I mean, I'll take it. I don't... Did it... Did Nido Queen miss at some point? Or does rollout work in like a way where it's like, hey, it's consistent, like, every consistent hit on the same Pokemon. And by me switching out, I changed it. Okay, so we we played with fire there, and we, we got really lucky. Like, there was no reason why we should have made it out of that. Hmm. Done sparse. Well, thank God you all died in one shot. I don't know when uh, Rubber Gone's gonna evolve, but I would definitely like uh, an evolution out of that. Maybe a better water move. Which I think I get Surf from the Kabuki Girls, right? Level 25 Scissor, Bug Fighting. All right, I'm not gonna risk Rubber Gone, but I will 100% throw Jotaro out to explode the scissor and split some XP. Yeah, that mock punch probably would have killed. Because though very much so it's obvious that rubber gone is water type, based on the fact that it's a rubber ducky, it's also part normal type. Which would not have been good. Though I think water resists fighting? 
funnily enough, so maybe it'll just turn it into, uh, even, uh, not even, just neutral damage. Alright, I'm not about to deal with you. Because I don't think I have anything that, I, like, 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 immediately deals with you. I no longer have the puff, and I don't have a grass move on me. So we're just gonna say no. Um, let's see. We got 15 minutes, so we're definitely going to be checking out the area off to the left, getting our first Pokemon there, probably doing a couple trainer battles, getting everybody up to 25 at bare minimum. 20 bucks says, I'll take the time to train up Kite Runner. So that way, they'll be ready for next episode. And while I'm doing that, the rest will probably grow with it. Like seriously, Rumpurgon needs at least like one more good water. And, and, but not even one more good, like, just a, one good one. Like, don't get me w wrong, Water Gun's not bad. But it's, it's just, no. Ooh, I'm wondering if we're gonna run into the same problem that we were in the route, like, south from here. Or we're just gonna run into, like, the same handful of Pokemon. Because it's nighttime. Oh, that's what Noctowl turns into. Interesting. Hmm, I like it. Uh, can I get away with water guns? I should be able to, because you're only steel flying. Yeah, I can I can get away with this. Though again, Noctowl technically different than some than everything we have. It's a part of the Hoot Hoot line, so that does not count as our first encounter, because we do have our Hoot Hoot Captain America. Or I should more pr properly pronounce it Captain America, because that's what that's what he is, Captain America. Not America, America. Mostly because there's not enough letter spaces for me to actually to go America. But, you know, it, it's also funnier that way. I will say I'm kind of sad that in the Noctowl design, they get rid of the shield. I wish it still had the shield. Um, at this point, I'm just more so trying to see if we can find like, a new encounter here. I know we're supposed like, in Pokemon 3D, we can run into... I think this is where we found our Magnum. So, like, I would like to be able to do that. I don't know if I'll actually be able to, but that's what I would like to do. I, I would like to possibly get a Magnemite here, even though I'm pretty certain it's going to be a Poison type, which isn't going to be helpful. figure out who might have like mean look because i feel like that would actually make catching the legendary dogs a lot easier because i think that just forces them to stay for five turns i don't know if they actually fight during those turns swift you know what it's still stab damage we're gonna get rid of minimize i'm never realistically gonna use minimize Kind of would have more so hoped for a water move, but maybe when we evolve into Porygon 2, maybe we'll maybe we'll get a water move. Uh, actually, we are level 24 now. I could probably go take on the rest of the. Hello. Know, what is up with the con my controller? 
I can only... The only thing I can think of is it's got... It's Emuhawk. Like, there's... Because I've never had this problem before. And I don't think I... I don't think this... Yeah, that's, I mean... Uh, yeah, I haven't had it happen with anything else. Like, I I use the same controller to play V Rising, and I haven't had this problem. So there's something with, like, the emulator that does not like this controller for some reason. Alright, I think we made it through, what, the first three? You had Umbreon. Oh, you're a Q-Trainer? Oh, you say the same thing as the first one? Man, they really did not, like, have a lot of dialogue for these ladies, did they? You're sending out Vaporeon, which is an Ice-type. Which, I don't think Water Guns are necessarily going to give me any real bit of difference, so let's go Swift. Because Swift should be stronger between the two, but, okay. So that did maybe a quarter... That, that might have been about the same. Alright, good news, unless you crit on one of these, I think I should win. Oh, hey, look, the crit that I was worried about. Okay, cool, even with the crit. Okay, heal up, take on the last kimono girl. Get Surf from what's his face. Teach that to to Rubber Gone, and just have an absolutely devastating move on on my little Rubber Ducky. Then people will not see it coming. You. So we're missing Jolteon, which is steel. So either I'm gonna have to switch, or I'm I'm strictly going to be. Okay, I like Jolteon. Jolteon's a little a little robot puppy, more or less. All right, 73. So that's 13 damage. Oh, cool! I flinched. Okay, that's another 13. Okay. How much does this do? That's not enough for me to keep up. I can tell you that right now. Uh, so we're immediately gonna say, uh, campfire go. Hmm, sand attack, interesting. Fire spin. Cool, that didn't do anything. Aha, we hit the fire spin, huge. Not gonna lie, a little surprised to auto one shot. Because I feel like I've seen... I mean, the Jolt... The, the Eevee Lucians do have, like, really good stat spreads. I think they're, what, 525s for base stats? Rubber gun, 25, let's go! And Campfire, almost 26. Ha, ha, ha. Okay, cool. Alright, old man. Surf me. Not only are the Kimono Girls great dancers, they're also skilled Pokemon. Uh, I always challenge them, but I've never uh, even left a scratch. The way you battled, it was like watching a dance. It was a rare treat to see. I want you to have this. Don't worry, take it. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And we got Surf, huge. Okay, well, at the very least, we all didn't have to sit through a bunch of off-stream grinding. We pretty much got the majority of the grinding done pretty quickly. Um, okay, so did HM go just straight to the bottom? They did. Okay, sir. Alright, rubber gone. We're gonna get rid of tackle. Maybe because I don't need it because Swift is better and having recover in my back pocket is actually really useful. Alright, um... Alright, I'm gonna go heal up real quick, and before we, like, fully end-end, 
Because ads are starting in two minutes, but I also have six minutes before I have to actually end stream, so we have a little bit more time than the ad timer. So, we will work with that. I at least want to do the first trainer over here to the left. So when I eventually do get to the point of like, okay, let's train up Kite Runner, we can we can actually, you know, just kind of walk around in this area and not have to worry about it. Um, I will probably catch Pokemon off stream because realistically I'll probably be playing during the daytime. So I'll actually run into different options. So, I have this, and then I have the one route to the south. Obviously, the, the, you know, honor code and all that, if I kill the Pokemon, I, I won't actually do anything. Right, Chelder Steel. Possibly Steel Water? Either way, Surf. God, I love the Surf animation. I forgot how good the Surf animation was in the original games. Like, how good is that? That's so good. Okay, cool. So that's set with that. Actually, wait. Do you want to battle? You know what? I'll hold off on you. Okay, I got an idea. I got an idea. Oh, wait. I don't know if you want to battle. Alright. So we're going to order those. Alright. For the last... Uh, like, three minutes. So, like, we're going to do this for, like, the next three... Oh, mill tank! Okay, okay, that's a new encounter. That's a new encounter. Oh, god damn it! Did it do the thing again? God, literally, I feel like anytime I bump this thing anymore. All right, level seventeen mill tank. It, it, it's got to be ghost, right? Um, maybe a water gun should be okay. Like mill tank still has to be tanky as all shit, right? So a water gun should be fine. Cause I don't think I'm gonna get get away with sending out. Wait. Su Ooh, super effective and it's served five. Hot damn! All right. Um, you're gonna get a great ball. Okay, I'm. I'm not gonna lie. I'm incredibly interested in this mill tank. Like the design of it's absolutely wild. The it, it, it's probably a fire ghost. Oh, a ground ghost. Okay, I, I mean, I get it. Ground ghost? Ground me? Get it? Beautiful, okay. I mean, g ghost cow, right? Mill tank. Meat. Yeah, ghost ground. Okay, called that. Uh, mill tank do not appear to be affected by pain. One has never been found completely intact. Jesus. Um, I'm trying to think. The only thing, other thing that comes to my mind is like trying to play off of like Bessie or something like that, like a famous cow name, but Bessie, but Boo, but then you just say Bussy or Boosy, and that's just too close to Bussy. And uh, no, we're gonna go Ghost Cow. Like I said, if you have better, a better, a better option, put put it put it in the the the, the comments below. Ghost. Okay. All right. So, especially with the fact that uh, Mill Tank is a ground type, if for whatever reason we lose Dino, and we could very well just quick replace with that there. Okay. I think that's the perfect place to go ahead and end this. So, if you made it this far in the video, first of all, thank you for your time. I truly do appreciate it. Like I said at the beginning of the video, if you're enjoying the content, definitely drop a like and a sub and let me know I'm doing a good job. Algorithm, good job. You, you, you heard the spiel before. You don't need to hear it again. Plus, if you made it this far, I, I would assume that you probably actually already hit the subscribe button at this point, which, by the way, thank you. Appreciate that. But either way, we're going to keep going. Uh, still haven't... Still only one loss at this point. Honestly, doing better than what we were doing with Pokemon 3D, so that's a huge bonus also kind of surprising because we don't actually 
know the typing of all the Pokemon we're running into, and we're just kind of flying by the seat of our pants. So, you know, we'll take that as a win. Either way, thank you for your time. I truly do appreciate it, and I will catch you in the next one.